welcome back to another Ruckus video. For today's video, we're gonna be installing this Yoshimura exhaust. I felt like Bone Crusher just then. Let's see if the youngins know what Bone Crusher is. But like I stated, we're gonna be installing the Yoshimura exhaust today, son. Oh, I can't wait. This is the last piece that needs to be installed before we can go do our speed test and go from 37 to hopefully 57. Damn, that's how long my dad been gone. Now, for my bike, it's gonna be different from yours if you have a completely stock ruckus. All I have to do to loosen out my entire exhaust is these two 10 millimeter bolts. What? 10 millimeter bolts. Huh? 10 millimeter bolts. Yeah. So now for the factory ruckus is, is two 10 millimeter bolts as well But you have a, like a bunch of other stuff on the other side where your exhaust actually goes But for me, I just have this pipe because it is an aftermarket exhaust So let's get this loosened up and get ready to throw this bad boy on. Oh my god I can't wait. So I was wrong for mine. It's two 11 millimeter bolts to get the uh, bolts loosened <laughs> My puny little exhaust is off. Now that I'm open headers, <laughs> hey, should I send the rod out the block? Now what I did was already just attached a muffler to the uh, exhaust pipe itself. And for this little spring right here, they do offer a spring for it. You will need the spring that go from here to there. They do offer a spring puller. I didn't even know they did, so I used some vice grips, not vice grips, but uh, needle nose pliers, and I did it. And then from here on out, we just attach it to there, the brackets, and we're done! For my ruckus, I'm gonna have the fatty tire on the back, so there's different brackets aside from the stock bracket. So that's why if you're watching this video and my brackets don't look like yours, then I'll link down a video to the ruck shop in case you're not running the fatty uh, rear like I am and you're gonna run a stock rear. Now for my bicycle looking bracket, this goes on like so. I have to remove this uh, hex bolt and then this one right here and then use the bolts that they provided. These two right here and these will go into the frame of the motor and then that bracket is done and then right here attaches to the exhaust so it stays up in the as I said so it doesn't be dangling and hanging and bling, la, 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 la. so there's absolutely no way I'm using those screws so we're gonna head up to Lowe's or Home Depot to grab some screws of that thread because I'm not using those those are just they're they're I don't know if you guys can see on the inside of the thread but it's like stripped on the inside these are not the factory nuts they can't be or whoever had this bike before me aside from Brian um, they they suck bro they, they, they suck. But the homie Randy's coming by, so we're gonna head up to Home Depot or Lowe's, either or, and uh, pick up some nuts. Come back and finish this install. Randy has no childhood. He don't, uh, well, he's never seen the, the little kid in Walmart Yoda. For real? He go, Daddy! <laughs> You've never seen that? Hey, that kid fires. Lil Hank Williams, bro. Oh, sweet. Oh, daddy! On our way to O'Reilly East to pay Tuck Tuck a visit. Gotta pick up a little uh, tap and die set. Hey, bro, why are you swerving, bro? Hey, bro! Boy, fast! Hey, do a pull in the traffic. Hey, hey, bitch. Uh. I ain't got Medicare yet. Uh. I ain't got good brains either. Somebody give Randy a $250 fine. You can't drive for it. Titanium exhaust for that boy Randy from the Rapids exhaust, and I'm gonna fix my exhaust. Wow, today's an exhaust day. Wow, <laughs> life brazy. <laughs> okay, so I'm back home now. It's time to fix the threads on this. So I got the uh, tap and die from Tuck Tuck Metric. The thread is M6 by one. In case you have this issue with your ruckus or something. Instead of using this tool, I'm gonna have to use my vice grips because, well, hopefully you can tell there's no room. But it's working for the most part. All right, one done. Let's see if it works. But it did, because I already tried it. But gotta do it for YouTube, right? Super facts. Boom, we're good to go. That side is now done, and that looked way better than that one. You gotta let them know right now I'm the best. You're the best. Thanks, bro. The best of what you do, bro. Thanks, bro. I respect yourself. Uh, wow. Uh, just like you uh, Wow, bro, that is, that's, in, that's incredible. All right, the exhaust is now bolted up to the head now it's time to do the bracket all right so i took the exhaust back off to get this bracket in because it was in the way so now we got the bracket in now it's time to mount up the exhaust and then the bracket for the exhaust what well, feels like hours later because it's already dark the exhaust is officially on fam 
Got the exhaust on. Now I can't turn it on because I don't have a gasket, so I gotta wait for the workshop to send me out a gasket. The new gasket comes in Wednesday, and that's when I'll be able to ride it and crank it up and show you guys how it sounds. Okay, so days later, your boy finally got his gasket from the workshop. One day shipping is like the best thing ever. I'm so glad that they're located in Florida because like everything comes like right away, so that's tight. So by the end of today, we should be driving the ruck with all the performance mods on it. But you guys might gotta wait on a top speed test. I'm gonna be having this time of my life. So this is. Is the little thing that I was waiting for. Now it's time to ride this sucker. Okay, so the bike is officially done with all the performance upgrades and part. Now we crank it up and um, hear our sounds first with the exhaust and then we rip this son. <laughs> you guys are gonna hate me for this, but Randy just texted me to go to the paint shop so we can help him uh, pick a paint code. Mine's already there. Randy's finishing up an alignment at his job. Then he's gonna, I guess, meet us all at the paint shop. So I'll give you progress on the RSX. And then we'll come back and uh, get the bike situated and turned on and ride it and show you guys the swagticity that it has. That boy Randy lent me the daily, boy. That boy lent me his daily. Well, Randy got like six cars. You know what I'm saying? When you come from Guyana and you sell all the sugar cane, you'll be able to afford like six dailies. I don't got that luxury. That's the Aston Martin, Merlo? Yeah. Uh, yeah. That was the one from the Audi that we... It, it's, uh, I think it's called Aston Martin, like, 1342 or something like that. It's called... And it's off of uh, 05. Damn. Right, yeah. right. It looks like FSU Burgundy. Randy's the color. Kind of like it. I like it. Ain't no surprise when Mai's around. Hey, do you want me to say it? Randy, I'm living in My bad, bro. <laughs> hey, then they go to RS6. Wait, I can record this, right? Yeah. <laughs> Man, all the body work looks done. That's sick. It's coming together, bro. Wait, I thought so about to be clean. <laughs> why does he, why do you get to record the color? Bro, huh? put it on your Instagram. <laughs> I don't want to put it, bro. Just, hey, hey, man, let the man put it on Instagram, bro. Bro, put it. I, I mean, this video ain't going to be out for like another week. <laughs> so, like. <laughs> don't be, never mind. Come on, man. I don't want that shit no more. <laughs> you heard my feelings. Back to the ruckus build. Oh All right, so I'm back home. Now it's time to crank up this bike. We'll start the bike for you guys, show you guys the sweet sounds of the Yoshimura exhaust. to Ryan for these past couple of days that I haven't been filming. Well, you guys wouldn't know that because I'm so ahead in video. We came to two factors that could cause why my uh, bike just wants to go without any throttle. It could be my carburetor and it could be my throttle cable. Now, being the awesome and dope guy that Ryan is, he sent me a carburetor he had that was spare and he already jetted it and everything. So all I have to do is just swap it in and then see if that fixes my issue to where like when it's idling, it just wants to go. So I'm gonna do that real quick instead of filming because I don't want to make drag this video for any longer. I just did a rookie mistake and sprayed brake cleaner on the engine while I was close up to make sure I get everything and brake cleaner shot at my eye. <sighs> so I almost just died. But aside from dying, look, hey bro, aside from dying, we have Mr. Steven O. Okay, let's pronounce your, your last name properly. Okasi, I say Ocasio. Hey, bro. Hey, no homo. What's up, bro? What's poppin'? I'm not using none of this. This, for me, is like in New Jersey. Oh, nah. You, you wait. Yeah, my car can sleep outside with no car cover. You ain't lying. It does look better. It looks better. Thank you. Even Steven says it looks better. I'm telling you, bro, y'all sleeping on me. Even though I haven't watched it in like three weeks or four weeks since it's been down. So this is the old throttle body, and I found my problem, I think. The flap is open, the butterfly flap is open. But uh, this one that Ryan sent me is like ready to go. So we're just gonna install it back, and that's it. All right, new car is on. Oh, homie, don't launch at you. <laughs> I, when I, when I, when I do rev it and it goes. 
the bike out in the beautiful sunlight. Uh, idle, I just adjusted the idle accordingly to what, um, just a pitch higher. And, uh, sounds great. Damn, it's chopping. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> trying to zoom in. He can't even zoom in. Okay. Okay. I think he's going to convince me to get a ruckus. Not bad. It bogs a little bit, but I think it probably do play. Sound like it has cams. Yeah. Not bad, though. I don't know if my spark plug is like. Did it, you change the spark plug, right? To a new one? Yeah, I, I got a new spark plug in. Oh, so you just, uh, with this plugs, you just put them in, you don't have to gap them? Yeah, yeah, nah, with, um, with these, like, now nah, you just put them in and it should be straight. Alright. Quick turn of events, we end up at Chick-fil-A, because that's what us thugs do. <laughs> Steven never had it, well, he had it, but he had it in New York. Yeah, and since it's the first time in Florida, we're gonna try it at, uh, my Chick-fil-A. And, um, he's going with the regular chicken sandwich, I'm getting the spicy one, because, hey, bro. Okay, everything you go with, the sauce, whatever you tell me. Polynesian, bro. Polynesian. My son, it hurts. It shouldn't hurt. I mean, you might feel a little <laughs> thumb, but it, it should be all right. How was it? It was good? High at Polynesian sauce, bro. Bro. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm, I'm a fiend. <laughs> that Polynesian, bro. no joke, bro. The chicken sandwich was just fresh. Like, they just killed the chicken in the back. <laughs> Bro, that chicken was so good, bro. That's Chick-fil-A, bro. Now I'm gonna have to go back to New York, do a 30 minute drive to Chick-fil-A. Damn, I'm addicted now. Do that you can make sure oh, you know man. don't forget yeah. the Polynesian, bro. Yeah, Polynesian, yeah, that's like the Polynesian. that's like the sauce on top, son. It's like a sweet and sour with like something I don't even know. It's just it's fire. It's, it's crack. crack. It's crack, bro. That's what it is. Now I know how it feels to be a cracky. <laughs> that boy Steven getting up out of here. Appreciate him coming down. See you guys. Where can they where can they find you at, bro? Where 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 uh, is your Swagness my, that my YouTube, uh huh. Steven O, like you said, watch Casio, so Casio, o Casio, okay. And uh, I'm the real probation uh, YouTuber. I only upload, <laughs> I only upload once a week, yeah. That is, <laughs> and, <laughs> and it's true. I just, I just realized today that he really only uploads since he said it four times a month, and I feel like he uploads like every two days, but it's okay. literally four times a month. I that wish. That's insane, I, I wish, but you know, I gotta. Monday to Friday job, got a little girl. But I do as much as I, uh, as I could. He's up and coming Josh too, came bro. Over. Josh let me come over. Hell yeah, he rode the ruckus you guys seen. He had a he almost, almost clapped my ass with, <laughs> with the back with the back fight, but not this Oh one. my god. It looks way better in person, guys. Hopefully you guys get to see it. That green. It's good. You like the green, bro? The cypress green look good. Oh yeah, that's the that's it. Trade for See? On what it came. But I forgot, would've came early, we would've got Yeah, we would've, got, we would've got this situation. This is, bro, this is just, God. This just ruins everything, bro. It really does. Like, the engine bay looks, oh my. Let's not talk about it, bro. But it looks good. Oh yeah, for the engine bay part, yeah. It looks good. From like here, that way, straight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just, just, just don't mind just, the, just yeah. Just it out, just, you know, just. Put some cardboard there, I go to a car meet. <laughs> hey, what engine you got, hold on. Put like a little block <laughs> outline, plug it over. Yeah, that's what I'm driving. Yeah, yeah, do not live, bro. Yo, thank you for having me. As always, bro, it's been a blessing. I'm glad you came down and showed some love. Yeah, all the way from all the way from New York. From the Bronx, right? Or Brooklyn? Isn't Brooklyn Bronx? Don't, don't, don't compare me to the Bronx. Wait, so the Bronx ain't Brooklyn? Nah, so it's Brooklyn, Bronx, Queens. Uh, Damn, I always yeah. thought Bro Brooklyn was the Bronx, because that's just short for Brooklyn. Nah, nah, nah. Y'all forgive me, no. bro. <laughs> forgive me, bro. Brooklyn, short for Brooklyn is BK. Bronx, okay. Short for Bronx is BX. Short oh. For is LI. Oh, shit. So I guess, yeah, I don't know what's short for, what's short for Florida. FL? Yeah, your boy from FL, bro. <laughs> I'm out here in these FL streets living this beautiful, luxurious jail lifestyle. Yo, you got Hun Dad on the raft? Wow, this 2J swapped? Hold on, listen to, listen to the camp. Look at that super, bro. Come next, come next, you here. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Damn, boy, got 2J power in the rap, daddy. Yeah. My G. Again, bro, As always, bro.
Get home safe. Let me know when you make it home. I'll text you when I get home. All right, I got you, bro. The homie Steven dip. Now it's time to ride the ruck in its entirety. Your boy is up and running and ready to go. Got the exhaust on, intake, variators, and weight, and CDI box. We're gonna give it a ride around the block. So uh, let's rip this thing. Everything is like 95% done. Now, I'm having an issue where like it bogs mid-range power. I talked to Ryan about it and he thinks it's the coupler that attaches from the motor to the carburetor because the clamps that are supposed to be there at our factory aren't there, so somebody obviously replaced that thing. It could be causing a vacuum leak on why that's happening. But other than that, the bike is almost dialed. Can't wait to fix it up. Cannot wait to get it dialed in the next couple of days to get you guys a speed test. So, so the video after this one would be a speed test on the ruck with the parts and see how fast a 50cc motor can go with just your basic botons and I hope we touch 50 bro like 40 okay my goal is 45 to 50 with the current setup when it's dialed like when it's completely dialed with all the parts on I hope to see about 45 to 50 so if that happens what a blessing but that's gonna wrap it up for the Yoshi Mirror exhaust install hope you guys enjoyed the video I know this video has been longer than what it is it doesn't take long to install the exhaust but Things happened in this vlog that I didn't film because, well, that'd have been just a long, dragging video. Thank you guys for watching. Huge thank you to the brush shop for supplying your boy with the Yoshimura exhaust. Can't just thank them enough. If you're looking to put some JDM swagness on your bike, link down below to the rug shop and to the exhaust if you're interested in picking it up for your bike. Thank you guys for watching. Smack that like button if you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out! Peace!